hello friend welcome back in this tutorial i will show you how you can use the check my links and what this new tool check my links is here on selectors of website if you go you will find the check my links uh, install link here so just click on this here we have mentioned all the details about check my links so check my links is a basically a free browser extension which helps developers and content creators seo professionals to quickly scan the web page like all the links of a web, web page where it will identify broken links active links valid links valid redirect links warnings any kinds of their so all those things it will scan on a web page for all the links very quickly just in fraction of fra fraction of seconds or just like two three seconds hardly and this is very very highly valuable and uh, <clears throat> highly value, valuable to maintain any kind of website to test the web links so let's see how you can install and use it it's very simple so here on this page you will find the installation link for all the browsers where it is available so let's say for chrome if you click on install it will open the chrome store links here you have to how you can install just click on add to chrome then add extension once you have added the extension, it will show something like this. You can close this pop up and here you will not be able to see the logo. So what you have to do, click on this default extension icon here and then pin it to toolbar. So you see that the select uh, check my links logo is here now. Now you can open any website on which you want to verify the links for which you want to verify the links. Just after opening the website or the web page, just click on this check my links logo and it will fetch all the links and verify them and show the result so here you can see it is showing two, total 232 links 230 is valid 2 is redirect valid redirect links and uh, rest like warning 0 invalid links 0 export all so all those options are there so this is showing at high level okay now let me show you on some other page as well like let's say where it will show more details like valid invalid as well so here on linkedin.com let's say we open this and here you can see that it's showing 107 and then whatever will be there like valid invalid the links count can be different because this is a social media platform if you scroll the page it more feed comes in so that's where it goes increase the number of links so don't uh, uh, just don't focus on the number of counts here because this might vary when you will open the uh, link uh, when you will open the website okay the main point here is that how many valid links how it shows the valid redirect link warning and invalid link here what all other features are there like here it used to highlight in green color and suppose you don't want uh, the valid link and uh, valid redirect links you want in like quite a different color so let's say this is in valid color valid green one quite a darker one and this is little different so if you want to change the color of this in uh, valid redirect link you can change or suppose you want to change this green color then you just click here and you can just change like whatever color let's say you want in blue color like this so then you can change the uh, highlighting color as well so that's one of the really good feature like it is highlighting invalid links in red color so in that case you just click here and you can change the color of like whatever it is highlighting so this way you would be able to change the color as well and if you ever want to uh, like reset all the settings you just click on this reset all button and it will make it to the default whatever it was then here <coughs> If you want to export all the links you want to download all the links uh, list you just click on export all it will download the seat and here you can see all the links available uh, which you have just seen here or if you don't want to download and you just directly want to see it here itself without downloading the file click on view all here it will show you all the links here you can see in this uh, local file here it shows the status code action if you want to view any of these links and all the links are available along with their uh status code like what is the status code for that particular link <laughs> also you have the filter here like if you want to uh, change the filter for the like by a status code you want to change that you can do it here similarly like if you don't want to see all of them or don't don't want to download all of them together you want like exclusively you just want to install or uh, you just want to export all the invalid or you just want to view them then click here and it will show them here it shows the status code and you can if you want to view you can view as well so this is how it used to uh, work it's very simple straightforward 
if you want to scan again like let's say we have uh, scrolled down the page and we want to again uh, do this again we want to check you just click on refresh button it will again check uh, scan the page and doing it calculation so this is how it works like if you want to do that if you want to close you can just close this or you can just like click on the logo or again click on the logo to close this if you click on the logo immediately it will start scanning the page there are some settings also available if you want to make any kind of change in the setting you just click on this setting icon and here you can include the pages exclude the pages for which you don't want to scan here you can see the method get head and all those things are available here for this maybe like i will create a separate tutorial for uh, to help you guys to learn more about this particular tool in detail so this was a quick tutorial about how you can check uh, how you can use the check my links to check the links on a web page and how you can make the best use of this particular very simple utility yet to save a lot of time i hope you guys will enjoy this particular tool it is already being used by more than 6000 users just in chrome store it's also available on uh, edge opera browser brave for all the chromium based browser it is available so i will request all of you to please check out this particular tool if you haven't checked out add it on your browser and it will be very very helpful do share it with your uh, testing groups QA community any uh, uh, with your team and those who need this particular tool it is very very helpful for all the developers <coughs> seo professional and the content editors as well along with the testers and developers i hope you enjoy this video and you will like this particular tool and it will definitely saves a good amount of for time time for you guys if you have any suggestion you can uh, raise a ticket here you will find more things here and we will be keep adding like installation how to check features video tutorial benefits of using this particular tool so uh, you will find all those details here on this page so keep checking out we will keep ad adding and updating this page and this tool is going to be evolve a lot this is the very first release we have done and you will keep seeing more and more updates on this thank you thank you so much please like this video and subscribe to the channel also check out these awesome informative videos and keep watching more videos on Selector Sub channel. Thank you.